All condensing boilers produce condensate as a waste product. Now there are a number of different options available to the installer as to how to dispose of this condensate. Now in this particular installation, the installer has chosen to run the condensate externally, which is fine. Um, however, during cold winter months, of course, there is a risk that this condensate could freeze. Now, if the condensate does freeze, that could potentially cause you a problem with your boiler, such as an EA code, a D5 code, or some form of gurgling from the boiler. That would, of course, stop your boiler from working. Now, if that does happen, what you need to do is take one of three steps. The first option available to defrost the pipe would be to get a hot water bottle and to put that onto the affected area of the pipe and allow it to defrost over a period of time. The second option is to go out and purchase some kind of a heat wrap, very similar to the heat wraps that you use for some kind of a, a muscular pain, uh, which would be available from your, from your pharmacy. The third and most effective option is to pour some warm water over the frozen part of the pipe. Now, please make sure you're only using warm water and not boiling water. Um, also, please don't attempt to do this if the condensate pipe has been installed above ground level. All you'd need to do is pour your warm water up and down the pipe to defrost it. Once you reset your boiler um, and you've got it up and running and working, um, we would still recommend, of course, that you get your installer back to insulate the pipe um, to stop it from freezing again in the future. Here at our Worcester Training Academy is a perfect example of a condensate pipe that has been fitted according to our manufacturer's instructions. In particular, the white plastic condensate pipe has been expanded from the standard 22mm to 32 You'll also notice that the, the root of the condensate pipe is directly vertical. And also, of course, the weatherproof sleeve, the insulation that has been put on the pipe to guard it against freezing during very cold winter months. Worcester have now created an innovative solution to stop your condensate from freezing. It's called the Condensure Siphon and here it is. It has two main functions. The first main one of which is the fact that the uh, volume of water within the siphon is half a litre. So a large volume of water or discharging at once under a greater velocity, a lot less risk of it freezing. The other function of course is the fact that this can actually um, be fitted to the central heating flow pipe. So it uses that parasitical heat uh, to transfer into the condensate uh, water so that not only is a greater volume of water being discharged, it's actually being discharged at a, a greater temperature. So this quite simply fits onto the central heating flow pipe. You should of course get your installer to, uh, to uh, do this for you. It can also be hidden away in a cupboard somewhere so you, you don't actually have to um, see it. Um, that connects onto there. Your waste from the boiler connects onto this pipe here and then the connection there takes you off um, externally to the property into your waste pipe and this will stop your condensate from freezing. Um, the three main benefits are there is no electricity being used so there's a cost saving there. It's very easy to install um, and the fact that there are no moving parts or electrical components within the um, within the product make it uh, very reliable. This product should be fitted by the installer and for more information please visit our website.